know. What it do, YouTube? It's your boy Richie Richmo back at it again with another video. I want to thank everybody. I want to thank every one of you guys right now for watching the channel. If you're new to the channel, make sure you do two things like subscribe. We are running every single day. And today, I am about to install my rear diffuser. You know what I'm saying? So, the rear diffuser that I have for Downforce Solutions, I'm going to be adding it to the Integra. And it's basically the one I had on the Lexus. I'm going to put it on the Integra. And we are about to get this shit rolling. I got the tools, everything I need. Shout out to my homie Paul across the street, my neighbor. And uh, it's time for us to get the car in here. So let's get the car. All right, y'all, so I finally finished my rear diffuser. Shout out to the homie Paul, my next door neighbor. Shout out to the homie, homie Josh, AKA Fluffy, the homie and my little brother, Zion. They helped me with the hand to hold it so I can mount everything. And this is my first time ever actually doing like a real modification like this. And I'm not gonna lie, the Downforce Solutions rear diffuser looks so badass on the car. Um, I will get the homie in, but he don't wanna get on camera right now. But how it look, bro? Don't. 10 out of 10. 10 out of 10. 10. I'm gonna show you guys how it look right now. So, wait, let me go. Look at that. Ooh, I just gotta clean it. But yeah, damn, it, looks good, good. it actually works. And then I added, I took the green off. If you guys don't recognize, this is my um, rear diffuser from the Lexus. It was green, but I took off the, uh, I took off the green part you see right there. So now I replaced it with some of that vinyl wrap I got. And uh, it looks so good. Once I clean it, I'm gonna do a nice little awesome. touchdown. It's gonna be ready for the meat. Oh yeah, ready for the meat. It's totally different. I'm the only one in the world with this one too, because this is my only, this one was the only one in the world. And now I'm the only one in the world with this rare diffuser for the car. So, oh my God, this, oh, bro, this it shit looks crazy. Oh my crazy. gosh, the app. bro. Oh yeah. oh yeah, this is sick. So we are going to the car meet tonight, but this is going to be a separate video. Um, I. Really wanted to show you guys how I did it, but time is, we are on the time crunch. But, uh, and I add, if you guys see my car right now, I added some black. So I'm gonna finish throwing like a few more pieces of black and then I'm gonna detail my car and then get ready for the car meet. Gonna um, be a second video. So you guys stay tuned for the next video tomorrow. It's gonna be the car meet, but right now I installed the rear diffuser. It looks good. All right, oh, my parents pulled up. Uh, shit, great. All right, so let me move my car. All right, y'all, so before I end this video, I want to show you guys a better look. This is the next day. I'm going to show you guys a better look at the rear diffuser that I put onto this car. It looks amazing. Like, amazing. I'm so, so, I'm so happy. And this car is coming along so fucking beautiful. I even thought of the name for my car. And it's going to be, like, trademarkable. And I think I found a name. So since my car is, like, orange and it got the black on it because I added some black vinyl onto it. We're gonna call this um the cheetah. You know what I'm saying? We're gonna name this shit the cheetah. I think that's dope. Um marketable. I can make some merchandise with cheetah and shit. A bust down cheetah design and shit. I think that's what we're gonna name it. So we're gonna name the car the cheetah. You know what I'm saying? The cheetah the integra. You know what I'm saying? I just thought of that shit in my fucking brain right now. So that's why I'm gonna roll with it. I'm gonna get stick with it because God worked in mysterious ways and that's the way that he works and I'm gonna do what he told me to do and we're gonna do that. But I wanna show you guys how the rear diffuser looks. So let's get my black ass out this car and I'm gonna show you guys how this shit look in the back of the car. It looks fucking amazing. So let's flip this camera around right now. Let's go. Oh, you know, you know me, I got a mess with you today. Oh, wait. Shoes, mess the goddamn car. But anyways, uh, Check out that rear diffuser though. It's dirty as shit, but I got to clean it. But that shit looks so fucking good. So basically, I took that shit off my Lexus. You guys know my Lexus from in the intro of the video. I took this shit off the Lexus right here. I do have two extra parts that go on the side, but they don't fit on this car. So it wouldn't make sense. So I just kept it in my trunk. It is windier than the bitch here. But I want to show you guys that in the fifth minute. Oh my God, this makes the car look so much. Yeah, 
it's witty as fuck. You can see that tree about to fall. Big chapter seven of hit my car. Um, but I love this car. It is turning out so amazing. I got people literally stopping me every second, taking pictures, asking questions, and just breaking their fucking spinal cords and necks, which is amazing. That's all I do. But I'm just excited, man. And like I always told you guys, all my OG subscribers. Damn. All my OG subscribers know, and I always told you guys this from the beginning when I had my 100. I always represent creativity. I always trying to represent those that step outside the fucking box. Stop doing what's normal. Stop copying everybody else's regular ass builds. Stop. That's just trash. Be creative. If you're a creative individual, step outside the box. Get creative with your car. Now, there's certain levels of too much creativity, but just be different. It's dope to be different. When I go to car meets or car shows, not even car meets because there's nothing different. There's all the same shit. But when I go to car shows, sometimes I see that car just stands out. That's just did something totally different. It looks it looks dope. That's um, that's inspiring. I love that shit. I, I get more juice than that than seeing a fucking McLaren or Lambo because it's just something different. I never seen. I always see the same ass cars with the same ass shit. Be different. Be different. That's all I can say. I love being different. And that's all you're going to see on my channel. If you don't like it, it's too different. Then you can leave. You know what I'm saying? So, but other than that, this car is fucking amazing. I love it. I love this fucking car. I love driving this every three seconds. And, um, yeah, this car came a long way. So, I'm excited. And just in the short time of me having this car three to four weeks, I've fucking done so much already. You know what I'm saying? Um, and I'm excited. Uh, another thing that I do want to say is, um, everybody out here, man follow your dreams i'm gonna continue to tell you guys this every single time follow your dreams take it to the next level um never stop you guys are actually watching me trying to pursue my dream i'm trying to make a hundred thousand subscribers you know what i'm saying so i mean i'm living my dream every day at a small small pace but just imagine it's going to get stronger and stronger and better and better as time go but i want everybody like you guys that's watching the channel Follow your dreams, man. Whatever it is, if it's to make YouTube videos, if it's just to be a, a top salesman, if it's to be a, start your own business, whatever it is, just be the best and learn as much as you can. Take some of your failures and just learn from it and just continue to keep blossoming because in order to be successful, you're going to fall on your ass. It's just That's just how the game goes. So follow your heart, follow your passion, follow your dreams, and everything else is going to work. And don't rush it because look at me. I had my child for a long time. I'm, only, I'm barely about to touch 4,000, but it's okay because my 3,000 feel like 3 million to me. That's just my personal opinion. And just for anybody to, to want to watch my videos or just come click it, I, I great, I'm I very grateful because you don't have to. You know what I'm saying? So I take the initiative and I'm just grateful for it. And I'm trying to live my days and my dreams together. And I want you guys to see. You guys are watching me. You know what I'm saying? Especially y'all watching me now. Before I hit 50,000, before I hit 100,000, before I hit a million, whatever the subscriber account comes to, I'm already watching me unfill, trying to unfill my life and live my best life. And I want you guys to do the same thing as I'm doing it. Let's grow together. Let's all reach our goals together. And I love you guys. Thank you guys for all the support. I am promise I'm going to try to drop as much video. Sometimes it's kind of hard to make a video now. I've done post so many goddamn videos in my life. But anyways, I want to thank you guys so much for watching this channel. Thank you guys for all the love. I truly, truly appreciate every single one of you guys. I love you guys from the bottom of my heart. Follow your dreams and follow your passions. Don't let nobody, nothing destroy you from making that happen. We out.